Hey guys, Keegan here, and today I'm going to be doing the video that I promised for today, which is, let me just pull it up, Fortnite. So, I promised last video that I would discuss the new, um, thing, the new, the new thing about this, um, what, that, what came, okay, so, yesterday I did a video because there was an update for the Fortnite, but I couldn't find out what the update was about. But then, after I made the video, I found out what it was about, which is what I was talking about in my Minecraft video. Both of those videos will be in the eye corner and the top right of the screen, if you guys want to watch either of them. But, um, yeah, in, in my Minecraft one, I promised I would record today and show what the new item was, which you can see up in the top right. And that new item is actually kind of hinted at with this skin now that I think about it. Yellow jacket. It's a bee. But these aren't bees, they're another kind of insect. They are fireflies. So in this season there are now butterflies and fireflies, sorry, where you can well I'll show you what they do in game. But also another reason I really want to do this video was because um if I click on Battle Pass, it's finally updated. So we have, oh, I thought we had week two challenges. <laughs> okay, so. Aquaman challenges, unlocks in 20 hours. Okay, so, none of those challenges are out yet. So, I did a big dumb. So I'll also do kind of what I did yesterday to um, tomorrow, where I'll do Fortnite and Minecraft in the same day. Tomorrow I'm going to show, I'm going to try and show you guys, um, some of the challenges and how I would try to attempt to do them. Because I, I like trying to attempt the challenges, and the last time I did it, I didn't do it on camera, I just did it by myself. It would be nice to share the experience. Now besides that, you guys might be wondering, well, where can you find fireflies? Well, to answer that question, I'm going to do a few solo games. And I will show you guys. So hopefully this can help. I heard that they only spawn at night, though I'm not sure how true that is. Because I'm pretty sure I found them pretty, like, early in the in-game morning. So I don't really know. But, once this is done loading, I'll tell you guys what I was gonna say. Okay, I'm in. So, what I was going to say is that, um, the thing about them is that they spawn a lot in this general location. They probably spawn a lot in other locations as well, but right here, in the orchard, they spawn a lot. So I'm going to land there and I'm going to try and show you guys it. And just to be sure, it does only spawn- this is actually really lucky, even if they do only spawn at night, by the time we're in the game, it should be around night time. So yeah. That's pretty good. Also, what the... Wait a minute. I think I'm just now realizing. I think the battle bus is always spawned in. Yeah, it is. For all the time, it's always been spawned in and I've just never seen it. I really want to shoot it. Battle bus launching. I want to see if it starts moving before the timer. Hmm. I guess I might just store it there or something. But um, yeah. So as I was saying, the orchard is one of the really good places to find fireflies at, and it's going to be nine times. So. No matter if the, th the thing that they come out at night only is true or not, at least it will be nighttime. So, yeah. But they normally spawn at the orchard and on that hill over there, or like on the map right there. It's my house? That's not my house?
picking up random stuff. And I'll be a bit more logical in a little bit, but because of the new fireflies, there are a lot more people landing here. I'm gonna have to be quite careful, because these are honestly probably real players. Oh, that was, um, crouch crouch, show that I'm a real player, but I'm actually being quite a lot of, like a bot right now. Okay, what do I want? So, I think I'm gonna keep the tack, because I'm, I'm thinking, even though the charge shotgun does a lot more damage, at least you get more shots with the tack, and it doesn't take long to shoot. So yeah. I'm not good. I'm gonna land at the orchard again. Because I really want to show you guys this, but honestly, by the time I land there again, it's gonna be daytime, so. Oh, pff. At least they get bad luck by having to face all these marauders with not that good of loot. Also, something interesting about marauders is that they can hear you, they can find you just by hearing you. Like, they don't have to see you in order to be, like, tracked onto you. Because, and I know that's true, because one time there were marauders, I heard them on the opposite side of a fence that I was on. And it was, like, one of those big fences so that you can't see it through it. And so I heard them, and so I hid in the house, and they started throwing stink bombs at the house. So, and they were all aggroed on me, so... I'm pretty sure that they can see you through walls. But that's just to get an educated guess off of what I know. at all today so I'm a little bit worse than I normally am <clears throat> so I, I think that first game was an okay one for my first game um, but yeah tomorrow I'm probably gonna make a video about me looking at the challenges and attempting them hopefully that will help you guys if you guys ever want to try out the challenge for yourself Nobody beside me better be landing at this house. How did he die? That was just a tree. It shouldn't have... Even if, even if he didn't... Even if he was at 75 health, he shouldn't have died from that fall.
That's strange. That's okie dokie. firefly jar and it's burning up the house I need to get out of here yep we threw that why did none of those shots hit those hit her directly or on my screen they did do they have like negative a hundred ping or something? Sure they weren't that accurate, but the shots still hit her in the legs. That should have counted. I should have done at least one. Sucks. There's been quite a few times where, for me or my friends that I play with, where we try and shoot someone and the shots don't register and all of their shots register, and that's also really unfair. Because it just makes it like, oh hey. Yeah, you could hit them. That wasn't miss. But you could also just not. People do that thing where like they're able to peek out from behind a wall. Without like being visible. Cause when I try and do it, like let's say I'm aiming for that girl. I go like right here and I'm halfway poking out. It's easy for them to shoot me. But there have been plenty of times where my friends are able to like hide behind walls and I can't see them at all. There's a lot about Fortnite that I could complain about, and I am complaining about a lot right now. <laughs> Sorry for you guys having to hear me complain so much. It's just... Yeah. Night goes quick! Yeesh. If what the people say are true, there aren't going to be going to be any fireflies. It's already daytime. Those of you who are newer to these videos, the reason I um, pause and unpause a lot is because um, if my mouse goes high up enough on my screen, it prevents me from playing really good. It's something that my the thing I use for screen share. Use this milk kit.
the sneak. They normally spawn in this field. Oh my god. At least I'm safe from him. any fireflies. There might be some stuff. No. That was a bot. They, either they left like insanely quickly after I shot them or it was a bot. The first is very unlikely. these spawn like I know they spawn because they're showing where the um supply crate is gonna land but like wow how does it spawn like it's just so strange to me This really sucks the way my screen sharing is working. Can't even hide them. <laughs> no one did do a bit better. Um whenever I'm not recording just because my the way I record, there's, there's this thing on the top of my screen that pops up that I can't get rid of. And it really sucks. I mean, for some games, it gets rid of it. Like Minecraft, which is a lot easier to record because of it. But then games like Fortnite, where it just doesn't ever go away, it sucks. There's nothing I can do to stop it. So yeah, it makes it like a real pain in a build fight. I mean, yeah, I, I didn't see any fireflies, so I don't think they spawned this time. Maybe they truly do only spawn at night. And if that's the case, then that might be the only reason I'm missing them. Normally the easy way to tell where they are is because um is to look at the ground. Because when it's dark, the ground on I thought I heard something. 
Yeah, the ground underneath them will go orange when it's darker. So yeah, it's probably a whole lot easier to find them at the night if they do only if they don't only spawn at night. But if they do, at least it makes it easier to find them in the night. <laughs> ages to go until night. But yeah, they're small and really hard to see. Yeah, you got to see a small um, function of them in my last game with the guy who set fire to the house. I do wish skill-based matchmaking was in the game, because then I could actually fight against people of my skill, and I wouldn't die every five seconds. Because without skill-based matchmaking, either I'll stumble upon just bots, people who are insanely bad, which is actually like really rare, or people who are insanely good, which happens so much. Or at least have a high, like a lot higher of a skill level than I do. Or, or, or again, or however people pronounce it. I don't really know the correct pronunciation of or, or orchard, orchard, whatever. I used to think that I had that email. And I was like, oh wait, it was a different one. And I was like, oh wait, no, it was neither of them. It was just like the really, really bad version of it. Where is it? I actually can't find it. Not that. Where is it? I have it. I know I do. This one, jump jacks. Oh, it was right there. But yeah, um, cause it's almost nighttime. That's trippy. That's also pretty cool how they made the reflection of the sun. That's the water. That's pretty cool. But um, yeah. So because it's nighttime, hopefully now I should be able to find some fireflies. And when I do, I would actually really like to show you guys the, the function of them. But I honestly did think the weekly update would come out today, because Fortnite came out more than a week ago, or Chapter 3 came out more than a week ago by now. And so that was weird, I haven't done that before. <laughs> I'm not gonna pick up pistols. Actually, I am gonna pick up pistols, but if I find some machine gun, then I'll replace it. short range things. So I'll take it for now. I'm too hard to nice. I normally put on like oh see fireflies. You see them? So what you can do is you can collect them. 
and now you get fireflies. They look like this. It's cool because from a certain disc, because in one video that I saw, they looked almost transparent. The bo the bottle looked almost transparent, so it was really cool. Please stop barking, little guy. <laughs> we don't want to give our position away. Oh, see? The ground's glowing. Collect. I saw something red over here, I think. Collects. <laughs> well, the first time I've ever collected them actually got fast. I now have three. Now, three is the most you can hold. If you try and hold on to more, it'll take up another inventory slot. So where is the puppeteer? I saw the puppeteer. So I'm gonna hide up here. I thought... I thought, um, decoys actually did damage, but I guess they don't. Over there. The times I try to get on the tire, I miss it every time. And then the one time I try to go down without- uh, and out of the house without hitting the tires, I hit the tires. I'm gonna hold on to med kit. I'm gonna leave that there for now. Just because I think heals are a little bit better. Because only the med kit, besides the chug jug, only the med kit can heal that much health. about these shotguns now like the range of how like it's so unfair shotguns are just so unfair because you could have a better shotgun and oh wait you're dead even though they had the worst shotgun it dealt more damage because it did that that's the only reason just because so basically fortnite is about having a random chance of finding items and then some of the items having a random chance of being good. That is constantly being randomized. So like, it, Fortnite in the set in a sense is technically just one big random game of luck. Cause you gotta hope no bots nowadays are gonna land on the building that you landed on. Cause humans don't normally land on the same house as you. And then you also have to hope that you're gonna get good guns from the house, and if you don't, then you still have the chance of, um, having a good, like, luck for your guns. you guys what they do. 
challenges, pick challenge, henchmen, damage to opponents, eliminate opponents. Okay, so I'm gonna do one more land at um the or orchard, orchard, whatever, and then I think that's gonna be the video for today. So I'm sorry if anywhere in the video you find like these weird glitches in the video. Because I saw that one time when I was watching one of my videos to see if it was good. And it was okay like in my files. But when I posted it onto YouTube it looked like really glitchy. So I'm sorry if it looks glitchy in some parts of the video. one of the factors of RNG that I just said. Landing and hoping to find a good gun. I found a gray submachine gun. They found a green AR. Who's gonna win? The person with the better rarity of gun. Except when the luck is like really bad for the gun they have and really good for the gun you have, except that never happens for me. Especially the time when the mythic charged shotgun, fully charged, 56 to a headshot at close range. That was the pinnacle of when I realized that shotguns in this game have been made absolutely stupid. Like, if, if they, like, lowered down the RNG of some of the shots, and I, I might be the only one experiencing it, but, like, it does feel, like, fully RNG-based. And if it isn't, then I'm amazed how the guns work. But um, yeah, that game was short. I'm gonna do one more. Unless this game is short, I'm gonna sh I'll do two more. But even if the second game is shorter, I'll make that the end. So yeah, all of these games have been landing at the orchard just so that I can find some fireflies. I really want to show you guys what they do. But if I keep on getting bad luck like this, I guess I won't be able to do this game. Better be landing at my house. It's my house. All of you bots go away. Because you most likely are bots if you're landing at the house that the other guy is already on. Oh hey, this is familiar. This is really familiar. <laughs> A green assault rifle? A gray SMG? What? I've never found some of the same guns twice in a row, actually, which is honestly pretty interesting. I mean, it wasn't the same type of AR, but it was a green AR. <gasps> Drama! I don't know why I tried to pin it, as if I, I had friends with me. Ooh. Nice. Let's see if I can find any upgrades. Because these guns are... I'll take that. No. 
I did that. Oh, my dog is getting rustled around. Where's my shotgun? Shotgun. Please. Heal. Damage. Oh, my gosh. That was... That was honestly so scary. I'm gonna go inside, and then I'm gonna go get that llama. I'm gonna be watching him. Oh my gosh, I was so lucky to have medkitted there. I would have died if I hadn't. Oh, and it's going to night time. So Firefly should be spawning. Yeah. This is my first llama of the day. I wonder if I'm the first person to search a llama. Probably not. People probably land on llamas. Oh. That obviously hit me, but okay then. I'll take it, thank you. I love making friends. Yeah. Let me just. I I'll understand if he kills me. Hope he doesn't backstab me. I like people who are nice. Oh, Firefox. That's how I normally go along with. Okay, so people who are like really nice, I honestly do want to let them go by because. I mean, if somebody's trying to, like, isn't even trying to hurt you and you just shoot them in the head, it's not that fair. Well, I mean, in a sense, it is fair because you're supposed to be fighting, but I'm okay if people don't have the best weapons or the best aim or anything. I'm okay with letting them, like, get a second chance or something. Go get some better guns, have a better chance. Like, like... Honestly, he could have had, like, a bunch of the best guns, but he could have just been trying to be nice. And when people are trying to be nice, I don't, like, be like, Thanks for your niceness. Goodbye, you did. Because that just feels, like, really mean. Honestly, I don't know if I have a challenge for today. I didn't. I thought I might have. So I did it. In memory of him. Actually, no, I don't want a golden pistol. I'd rather a better tack. And I'm okay if I find like a really good tack in this build, in, like a purple tack in this next build. I'm okay. With that. Rags the riches. What? <gasps> That's the final um making thing. Oh, it's okay. Okay, so um. For you guys who don't know, I've been trying to do like a bunch of punch cards this season. And so, they all correspond into groups. Like, in the punch card menu, 
you can see which group punch cards belong to which. running. I could have stayed in the storm for a little bit. I just wanted to get away fast. Oh my gosh, Marauders. They see me, but definitely. So, um, I didn't get to show you guys what they do, but yet, um, okay, you know what, I'm gonna keep on playing, and when I find a, um, when I find more fireflies, I'll resume recording, and then I'll show you what they do. Just at the end, okay? Be right back, hopefully a little bit. Okay guys, I finally found some fireflies. I've played so many matches and haven't gotten any. But um, yeah, the main purpose of this video was to show you what fireflies do. And you already got a small look at what they do, but I'm gonna show you guys a little bit more. So I'm gonna throw this into the very middle of the house. And I'm gone. Yep, they start fire. Also, I really need to use these. I haven't found a single med kit anywhere. Yeah, that's what fireflies do. Well, at least I got to show you guys. Yeah, they spawn at night, and you can also get them from marauders. So yeah, um, I think that's gonna be the it for today's video, guys. Um, yeah, let's just head back to lobby. Kind of, I wasn't really paying attention to what I earned. I earned. Oh, I know that. I know that. I saw that one at some time. I don't remember when I saw it. I'm pretty sure that's when I'm scrolling through the battle pass back in my battle pass video. Which could also be in the top right corner in the eye box. This is also my first time doing a lot of these eye box things. I think it's just really cool that you can feature videos in your video and give like really quick links to them. So I think that's pretty cool. But yeah, besides that guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today. I'm going to stop sharing. But yeah guys, I hope you guys enjoyed today's episode. If you did, make sure to hit that like button. If you really enjoyed it, then make sure to subscribe and hit the little bell beside the subscribe button to never miss out on any of my future videos. Besides that, I hope you all enjoyed and peace. Also, the really bad thing about this recording software is that I have to go on for a while. Yeah. But to double up the outro, again, I hope you enjoyed, and peace.